Good morning everybody and welcome back to the Sullivan family. So it's Friday, it's the day before Christmas Eve. As you can see, I'm quite liking these new hats. They're nice, aren't they? <laughs> Zoe bought me a new Christmas hat because my other one was so tatty. She said, you're not wearing that anymore. So, so she got my nice new one, it's nice, isn't it? I've also shaved my head. So I've shaved my head, so it's keeping my head warm. So it's nice. Anyway, we are keeping the Christmas theme going. Obviously the Vlogmas 2022 theme going. Um, today is a little bit more chilled out than yesterday. Yesterday was absolutely crazy with the shopping, the shopping trip and all that because it kind of, it kind of takes over the entire day because basically I'm at home sorting out the kiddies. They were having their last day at school and all that kind of stuff, and that meant so we could then go off and do her shop, or do our shopping, sorry, our Christmas shopping with the other girls. So that's that's fine. So that was all done and dusted. Um, so today is more number one. It's a bit of a chill out. Number two, I've got a tip run booked because I've got about two or three, I say tip runs, they're now called recycling centres, aren't they? They're recycling centres because you recycle your wood and your cardboard and all that kind of stuff. So all of the furniture that we broke down in the bedroom over the last month or so is just stacked in the garage and it needs to go because I need to make space because obviously um, after Christmas Day, we're going to end up with about 10 bin bags full of recycling. So obviously, uh, you know, Christmas wrapping paper and cardboard and, and packaging and all that kind of stuff. So we need to make some space. So I've booked a tip run for this afternoon. Uh, Noah's going to come with me on that. But what we need to get done this morning is to load the car up because I don't want to be doing it straight after lunch. Because I've got to, I've got to be there for about half past one. So, um, yes. Zoe's going to have a bit of a blether with you as well. She's upstairs. She's preempting the girls' beds. So she's doing the girls' beds this morning, but she's going to have a vlog with you. Anyway, because she she was on um, BBC Radio Scotland this morning um, with uh, Roy Han, which was the other family we were on the TV with on the BBC. So they were doing a bitty about um, Christmas and, and all that kind of stuff, you know. So that was nice. So she did a bit on, on BBC Radio Scotland this morning. Um, yeah, so tip run this afternoon. Uh, pack the car up this morning. I'll get the kids out on their scooters if they want. Oh, if they want to stay in, they can stay in. We're going to kind of just chill, chill out today, really. They don't have to come out with us this morning if they want to. They can stay in in the war and whatever they want to do. Um, but we'll be outside anyway till I've got a load of car up. And then after lunch, um, it's straight over to the t to the tip, to the sorry to the recycling centre. I keep calling it the tip, but it's the recycling centre. So we're going over to the recycling centre in Elgin this afternoon with Noah, and then after that, we're going to go for a walk to the premier because we had a bit of a disaster yesterday. Um, Joseph's got a, an old iPhone 7 um, that he uses um, should his iPad run out. It's gonna sound crazy, because he's, he's not on his iPad all day, or his phone all day. But should he have be having a bad day or whatever, and um, his iPad runs out, we've got this backup phone, so I've got exactly the same on the phone, you see what I mean? But we lost the phone yesterday. So it was a bit of a disaster, so we couldn't charge it up, or we, couldn't, we didn't know where it was. Um, so as, as we were searching for it all day and I was getting the kids to look for it and they were, they were half attempt at looking at it. So I said, right, well, um, if you find the phone, you get a quid, right? You get a pound. Um, so they started looking a bit harder and by the end of it, by this morning, it was three quid it was up to. Somebody find that damn phone. So Toby found it and he wants to go up to the premiere this afternoon and go and spend his three pound blessing because he, he earned it. He was looking all night and uh, not all night, obviously, but he was looking yesterday. He was looking this morning, found the phone. So he got his three pounds. So after we've done the, the recycling centre run, we're going to go for a little walk up to the premiere to, forget, to get a bit of fresh air, maybe stop at the park at the end of the road. So, yeah, it's going to be one of those days today. It's just going to be a bit of um, chill out. Get a few things done um, in preparation for Christmas Eve tomorrow, which we can't wait for. Obviously, we get our, we've got our family tradition of going to the beach and getting a, a photo with all of our Christmas hats on and that kind of stuff. So that's that's a nice thing we're going to do tomorrow. And I think Zoe's going to do a bit of uh, Christmas dinner preparation tomorrow, I think, some of the veg and stuff. But anyway, Christmas Eve will just evolve as it does, finishing with putting stuff out for the reindeers and Santa, you know. Can't wait. The kids are really excited. So as for now, I am going to get the kiddies ready, I think or whoever wants to come outside and we'll go and load the car up. So um, I'll see you in a minute. Okay, as you can see, there's a lot of stuff to take. So there's gonna be about three or four um, trips to the recycling center. I might do the cardboard actually first. Should we do the cardboard first today? Yeah. 
Yeah, so we've got cardboard to take, all the wood to take from the old wardrobes and the old um, chest of drawers. Some rubbish has got to go, which is left over, some plastic. So it's all kind of recyclable stuff. So, um, right, first thing I've got to do, I want you lot to come in here. Give me that. You lot come in here a sec. Okay. Right, listen. You need to stay in the, listen to me. Right, you're not listening, are you? Look at me. All right, look at me. Okay, so I need to stay in the garage because I'm going to bring the car round. Okay, so you need to stay in the garage until I've brought the car around, okay? Say oh. yes, Daddy. Yes, Daddy. Right, okay. Right, let's put that up there for a minute. Daddy. You've got to go and get the car. <laughs> yeah. Right, I've got the car in. Um, we're gonna load up. There's gonna be a bit of time lapsing today. It's obviously easier because I have a lot of loading up to do. So, are you all ready to help me? Yeah. Yeah? And then afterwards, once you've helped me load the car up, you can have a, they can have a, a ride on your bikes, yeah? Yeah! All right, Erin. <laughs> right, we're gonna time lapse this bit. We're gonna load the car up. Everybody's done a cracking job. I've got as much in the car as I possibly can. It's filter bursting. We've got all of the drawers in there, didn't we? All the wooden drawers, all the cardboard's gone in there. Uh, some rubbish. What else has gone in there? Loads of stuff in there. So we literally filled the car to the top pretty much. So thank you very much for your help. 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 Right, you can go and ride your bikes now, but wait a minute, let me move the car first and then you can go and ride your bikes, okay? All right? So get your bike. All right? Yeah. Okay, good. Right, I'm gonna go move the car. Brilliant job. <laughs> good morning. So it's Thursday, Friday, Thursday, Friday. What day is it? It's Friday. Um, see, this is this is when it starts, isn't it? The, the not knowing what day it is when it's Christmas. Um, it's Christmas Eve, Eve. That's what it is. It's Friday. It's I got fluff on me. I'm doing cleaning. So all my weekend jobs that I normally do, as you know, if you've probably followed this for a while, I'm normally rushing around cleaning at the weekends, doing the bedrooms, etc., cetera, etc. Cetera. I'm not doing that this week because. Sunday is my bed changing day and Sunday is Christmas day so there's no way that's happening so we're just doing the beds now so we're doing the beds um tidying round doing the last of the bits because I don't know if anybody else does the whole blitz in the house before Christmas I don't know why we do it because you know who's actually no, we haven't even got anybody coming I get it if you've got like people coming but we haven't I th the only reason I do it I guess really the reason I do it is because um I like to give myself a few days off over Christmas and when I say a few days off 
I mean, I've still got the washing and the cooking and all that to do, but and the day to day stuff, but giving myself a few days off the big jobs. So I guess that's why I do it is just to to get everything nice and clean so I can feel better in my head and um, and I feel that everything's kind of clean and tidy ish as tidy as it can be with like 14 people at home so obviously Ben's been out loading the car for the tip um, so that's got rid of a lot of stuff I've got a few bits and pieces to do today I've got some last minute Christmas stuff to do um, and then by tomorrow I think most things will be done so I think we can you know I wanted to just get to Christmas Eve and just be able to relax um, and enjoy a few days of well it's not really you know relaxing I'll be cooking but it's still relaxing just uh, enjoy a few days of just family time Christmas family time not having to do all the other things that's the best thing for us about Christmas really is is the everyone being at home everyone being together um and just enjoying the time, the downtime, really. You know, we haven't even got a jigsaw out yet this year. Normally, we've got a jigsaw out that we're everyone's kind of trying to put their two pence in to do. So we need to get one of them out. You know, we've got board games nights that we need to have, cheese nights. We haven't been able to do any of that with the kids at school right to the last minute. Um, we haven't done any of that sort of stuff yet. So we'll be cramming it all in to the next couple of weeks before they go back, or the next week, really, before, obviously... Ben goes back to work before the kids go back to school um so we've got like a good week really that we can kind of enjoy all that stuff so it's quite nice that Christmas is on a weekend because that's obviously Saturday and Sunday and then we can enjoy the rest of the week to have some proper family time um before New Year and then Ben will be going back so we're going to make the most of what we can really we're going to make the most of the time we've got do as much as we can um it just feels like it's um kind of with everything right up to the last minute the kids at school to the last minute they're all a bit um they're all a bit tired and grumpy so it's always it's always difficult when they finish really late because they don't get that time before to kind of wind down and um just relax really before christmas so they're all a little bit wound up but it will be fine i'm sure it'll be fine um it'll be fine so anyway, I'm just catching up with some bits and pieces today, getting lots of stuff done. Um, obviously, we've got the food in. We've seen the food shop. The food's in. Um, no one's allowed to touch it before Christmas, though, which is kind of now. So, you know, does anybody else do that as well? You know, the food is Christmas food. You can't touch Christmas food until Christmas. It's the rules. Anyway, um, it's nearly lunchtime. I'm going to finish off in here and go and do some lunch. Well, that was a job well done. So we've got the car prep now ready to go for after lunch. Zoe's uh, pretty much wrapping up. Well, she's she's doing a, a thing upstairs. Um, it's about it's about quarter past eleven now. So I think what we'll do is we'll go inside and we'll start doing lunch. Cause we're doing early lunch, which means I can get to the tip earlier, the recycling centre earlier, and then we'll go out for a walk, shall we? Uh -huh. Yeah, do we go out for a walk upstairs? Daddy, I've what? always gone to the recycling centre. I can only I've only got. I've only got one seat, baby, and Noah's bags it. Noah's coming with me, all right? Maybe another time, okay? Right, we're going in.
Okay, that's lunch done. So um, it's me and Noah going off to the recycling centre in Elgin. Uh, we've also got to pop into Elgin as well to go into Argos because we're picking up a little surprise for the little ones. Another, it was, it's the last. They had some money left over. So we've clubbed it all together and um, they've got another little surprise for, for Christmas. So that's nice for them. Um, I'm not going to say what it is just in case they watch the video. <laughs> so it's going to remain a surprise. Anyway, so are we ready to go over to um, Elgin? Yep. Got to do a bit of time lapsing now, a bit of time lapsing driving and also time lapsing at the um, recycling centre. So we'll catch up with you in town. Then, yep. Right, we're done in Elgin. We've been to the tip. We've got rid of all the junk, apart from a few bits of wood which they couldn't take today. Um, but we're pretty much done. So we've picked up the extra bit from Argos. Um, town's not too bad actually. The roads were a bit busy, weren't they, Noah? Yeah. But the town's not too bad. I'm quite surprised because I would have thought it would be nuts by now. But um, maybe it'll be crazy tomorrow. I don't know. But we're going to head home now because the kids want to go to the shops. They want to they go to the premiere. Um, for a bit of a walk, so we're gonna go home, aren't we? Cool, right, we'll see you at home, guys. Right, we're home. I've rounded everybody up. I've got Agnes with me, Leah, Erin, Noah, Eva, who else have I got? Charlotte, Flo, and Toby. Agnes is Toby. How did you do that, darling? Hang on, hang on. How did you do that? Did you bite your tongue? Oh, it looks Ooh. sore, doesn't it? She bit her tongue somehow. How did you bite your tongue, darling? I hey? did it. I don't know why I do. Did it. Okay, she doesn't I know what she did. It. it will stop in a minute because some. It just looks bad, but it will stop in a minute. I promise. Can I tell them why I've got a Yeah, go on. So uh, the cat has his claws out, and I picked him up, and his paw hit my lip. The cat's lethal. Cool. So um, when we first had Oreo about eight years ago, 
I didn't know you didn't buff a cat. Oh yeah, he buffed the cat and he got scratched everywhere. I had like, it just tore me to shreds. The cat tore me to shreds. So I, I ended up, <laughs> thought I'd have to get to A&E um, at one point. Um, so top tip, don't bath the cat. And daddy, they don't like it. And now, thank daddy, my, my, tongue, I, my tongue really hurts. Yeah, I know. I don't know what you did. I don't now, know what you did to it. on Christmas, um, we don't do any swimming. <laughs> and we don't do any dates in our family. No. It's cool. It's called having a break. It's called having a break from normal responsibilities for a, for a week or two, which I can't wait. Which I'm doing now, to be honest. What's that? We've got lots of telling us something. This is rain. It's not going to be here after Christmas because she's looking after a child. Oh, right. Okay. That's nice, isn't it? No, she got a Okay. Alright. <laughs> okay, cool. So um we're just walking to the premier. We're walking to the premier because I promised I to get, get them some sweeties it. for afternoon Daddy, snack today. Can I tell them what I can wanna get? What? A brain liquor. A brain liquor? You're not getting a brain liquor? Daddy, no Daddy, way. Daddy, we can't even eat our brain liquors anymore, just we haven't even you're not having a brain liquor because it makes your brains explode. Daddy! <laughs> what? There's a letter on the door. Alright, okay, cool. And a big star. Alright, okay. Daddy. Big star, apparently. But we really and part of can, we eat okay. our, can we eat our snacks at the park? No, we're not going to the park today. Yeah, it's already getting dark. So we're just going to go to the shop and we're going to get a snack and we're going to walk home. It's just to get in a bit of fresh air. Alright, we're going out tomorrow to the beach. I just... I just saw a few seven. <gasps> Did you? No way. So, anyway, like I said, there's nobody here. We're going to walk to the premiere and they want to get a snack. But, but there will be people at the premiere. There will be people at the premiere, won't there? There's Quick, get off the road, on the road. There's nobody here. Boingy, boingy. Boingy. Boingy, boingy, boingy. boingy. Boingy, boingy, boingy. Rabbit. It's a rabbit, Flo. <laughs> Are you tipping Flo? Hey! Hey! You're so cute. Oh, I like the Christmas tree. The Christmas tree's nice, isn't it? I love it. Very Christmassy. Oh, I like the tinsel. Very Christmassy. Right, what are you grabbing? You're, you're gonna, you want one of those, do you? Yeah. Okay, right. We're gonna go look at the sweeties. You two come over and look at the sweeties. I think Toby wants to spend his pennies. His pennies for finding the phone. What's that? Is that all you want? Yeah. A lipstick? Yeah. Okay. Um, what are you used to getting? I've got a sorry pouch kids. Well, I need to get refreshers in a minute. So I need to get some of those. One, two of those. I don't want them. One, two of those. Okay. What are you getting? You're getting that, are you? You want that, Noah? Okay. I don't want refreshers. What are those? What are those? No, like oh no, get something normal, okay? Is gum? No, it's gum, yeah, yeah but it's, it's hard, gum. crunchy gum. Get something a bit normal, okay? No, not chewing gums, I want you to get a snack, okay? So, something like a flump or a fresh juice or something like that, yeah? No, darling, you've got tons of chocolate, yeah? Um, okay, you can have one of those if you like. Yay! All right. Daddy. Are you sure that's all you want? Daddy. Darling, is that all you want? The teacher stole all the drinks. Oh, no. What have you got? Show me what you've got. Daddy. Okay, that's fine. Okay. Oh, it is. We've got those. Right, we're going to go and pay in a sec. Daddy. Well, we're walking, can we eat? Yes, you can. Yeah. Uh, stinky. 
Thank you, Dad. Alright, are we all good? Have we all got everything that we want to get for? Candles! Agnes, have you got yours? I don't need candles, darling, for days back. We've got thousands of candles. Right, let's go around then. Let's go around to the till. It says happy birthday, I know, but it's no one's birthday, is it? Oh, I don't like a big onion. It's not an onion, darling. It's a lettuce or a cabbage. I think it's actually a cabbage. Daddy, let's go. Food. Come on, let's go and pay. Let's go and pay because I want a cup of tea. That's a storeroom. Right guys, that's it. We're finished in the premiere, aren't we? Have we all got our sweets? Yeah. We've all got our sweeties. So um, it's actually getting dark now. It's about 10 past three. We're gonna wrap the video up because we've got lots of preparations to do tonight. Christmas! For no, for tomorrow, which is Christmas Eve. Yeah, because I, 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 I think the elves might be going tomorrow. I think they might be gone by tomorrow, it's the elves. Christmas Eve tomorrow. So who knows what's going to happen tomorrow morning because yeah. that'll be exciting, won't it? Yeah. Our Christmas oh, yeah. Eve, yeah. So we're finished for now. Um, come here. We're finished for now. Um, it's going to be an exciting day. Hang on, wait a minute. It's going to be an exciting day tomorrow because it's Christmas Eve. Um, but it's been a lovely day today. We just caught up with a few things, you know. Right guys, there we go. Really hope you enjoyed the video today. Loads more videos to come. Please subscribe to our channel if you haven't already. Please hit the bell for notifications. How many videos are we going to do? Drop us a like. Well, we'll see. We'll just see. And we'll see you in the next video. Bye!